Alrighty, hello again, bronies, Pegasus sisters, and non-believers. I am Raz, and I'm here today with Call of Duty Zombies. Yeah, it's been a while since I've done anything Call of Duty related, hasn't it? I don't think I've really done anything since Black Ops 2 launched last year. Huh. I just thought of that. I'd... Sorry. Anyway, it has been a while, and I kind of promised a while ago I would, uh play some zombies and do the campaign as a let's play and you know more multiplayer and all that and you know I kinda just stopped playing Call of Duty for like uh, six seven months straight there don't know why I just lost all interest in Call of Duty in general but as of a couple of months ago I started playing it a lot again multiplayer especially and a lot of zombies I don't know what happened, I just suddenly turned zombies on one day and, you know, two weeks later I hadn't really played anything but, so I thought well, I might make a video of it while I'm there. Why I haven't sooner, I don't know, but hey, I figured now's as good a time as any, considering as of today, we finally got the fourth and final map pack for Black Ops 2, namely Apocalypse. Yeah, I'm sure a few of you are scratching your head in confusion because the Xbox guys got it a month ago. But for us PC and PS3 guys, we had to wait till now, the 27th of September. Technically the 26th, but you know, Australia, we're a day ahead of you guys in America. And that's where the games come from, so I had to wait until like 3 o'clock in the morning and then download it, and then I tried to play it, and I failed on the first round. Seriously, I got two zombie kills and then died. That was just atrocious. <laughs> But anyway, without further ado, I'm going to go solo because for one thing, as you probably saw, I'll just back up for a second, there aren't that many people online. There are about 2,000 people, which is actually a lot more than I usually see playing zombies, but even then, I tend to play zombies single player. That's just what I do. So without further ado, I'm just going to zone into Origins. Now, I want to illustrate that aside from my uh, 3 o'clock romp of one round death, I haven't really played the map as of yet, so I apologize in advance if I completely miss some really obvious important detail or, you know, completely walk past something vitally important to my survival. I really don't know what I'm doing with this map. I know some of the basics, having watched some of the Xbox guys play it, but I don't really know the layout of the map that well. And aside from the spawning room, I don't really know the map at all. So I apologize if I completely fail or run into a wall or something. First time, uh, uh, <coughs> excuse me, I just stumbled over my own words. First time noobness is going to happen, so yeah. Hopefully that's not going to be an issue. But I'm going to shut up for the next couple of minutes because I'm going to let the intro cinematic play even though if you're anything like me you've probably already seen it 20 bajillion times on loop because hey that's just what I do. Anyway, I'm going to shut up, let the intro play, and then I'll be back when the game officially starts. So countdown begins. See you in a minute. Oh, we've got five seconds, hold on. <clears throat> Here we go, in a minute. began long ago, on the battlefields of the Great War. Two German scientists sought to harness dark and mysterious forces buried for centuries. They believed their discoveries would assure Germany's ultimate victory. What they could never have imagined was just what else their research would unearth.
My name is Samantha. I'm going to tell you how all this really began. Field report. Confirming arrival at site identified in our intel. No sign of the target, nor the other agents believed to be on intercept course. Dempsey out. <clears throat> Alright, apologies for the long gap in my voice there. As I said, I wanted to let the intro play. Freak! Some of them bit, hold on. There we go. I wanted to let the intro play. And, uh, yeah, I wasn't joking about that whole watching it 17 times since it was released. I have actually watched it a number of times on YouTube since uh, Treyarch released the intro. Don't judge me. Anyway, yes. So this is pretty much my first official run through of the map. As I said, I have played it once when I was dead tired and completely sucking, and I have seen a bit of it on, you know, I watch NGT Zombies channel a lot, so I have seen some of the I'm Easter eggs off. and certain parts Target of the map area like that. Affected by an unknown contaminant, enemy personnel degenerated to their primal instincts, exhibiting irrational and unparalleled savagery. Recommend all allied units set up exclusion zone until further intel is available. Sorry, I'm trying to let the characters talk when they want to as well. But yeah, I have seen... Hold them for what, 10 seconds? I have seen a bit of it, as I said, you know, watching some of the easter egg videos and some people let's playing it, like C-Nanners and Entity Zombies and that. I've seen a bit of the map, so I have a rough idea of how things work. But yeah, I really don't know much. <clears throat> excuse me, much of uh, the actual layout from a player perspective. I've seen the map in action, but I crap. I don't actually know where everything is in relation to where I am now. So this will be interesting, hopefully. Covered further evidence of large-scale mechanization of German forces. Attempts to gather intel being hampered by the infected enemy. Okay, lots of story happening. I like that. More so in single player, I think, because the characters aren't talking to each other. They kind of have their own dialogue specific for single player. Which is cool. Oh, crap. Don't you dare touch me. I haven't got my revive soda yet. <sighs> but yeah, as I said, I do know the basics of the map. Brain come from the cadaver the German had in his bunker. But yeah, I can't really say I'm going to be very good at it on my first playthrough. That was almost my head there. Whole lot better than a taste. Crap. See what I mean? I'm already failing. I'm only on wave three. I'm usually a lot better than this. I guess because I'm splitting my focus. But oh well. I won't make a very good YouTuber if I can't learn to micromanage my talking and my gaming. This anyway, won't keep them out points. for long. Whoa! Hello. Where do you think you're going, Sonny? And yes, I'm not the best point hoarder in the world. Don't judge me. This is just how I roll. I haven't gotten a max ammo in a while, so I can't really rely on that. To, you know, use my pistol more reliably. This one. This two. And yes, as I said, I have seen a number of the Easter egg videos. I'm gonna go this way. See where it goes. So I do know how to get some of the music tracks and all that to play, but uh, yeah, in relation to where I'm going to find all the items, not a clue. What's that? Oh, oh crap, this is bad, this is bad! I got distracted by the shinies! Oh, now I got a max ammo when it's not relevant anymore. Let's make these bullets count. Okay, I'm gonna get out of here because this is really narrow, and the robot's stumbling past. I don't think I'm ever gonna get used to that. First time I played, saw that thing stomp past. I meant I nearly. Uh, let's not go there. But yeah, looking up through the hole in the roof and seeing that thing stomping past is just terrifying. I can't imagine what it's going to be like when I get out into that area where I can actually step on them. I'm pretty terrified just what. Oh, hello. Double points. Just watching it on videos. I can't imagine seeing it firsthand. Wow, there's a lot of you guys. Where are you all coming from? I barely opened one door and you're just pouring in. And that's the end of the wave. Great. I was kind of hoping to keep one alive so I could explore for a minute. Blood money. Thank 
you. Don't mind if I do. I'm actually off to a pretty good start, point wise. Please, you have to help me. I'm trapped here. I just want to go home. Well, what the? Did anyone just hear a little girl? Well, I'm glad I'm not the only one. For a second there, I thought I was losing it. Anyway, another generator here that works. What's that? Blood? Zombie Sweet. Blood. I got some kind of stink all over me. I think it's making him back off. I'm digging this. But yeah, as I said, I have a rough idea where to go, but I don't really know where be careful, everything the is. Approaching. Ah, crap. You might as well be fishing a barrel. Might as well, they're not looking at me at the moment. In about two seconds it will be. Ah, oh, my vision's cracking up. <coughs> Grenade, hopefully we can get a- Whoa! Crap! He's gonna stay here. <laughs> Sit down, please. I don't like you right up on my grill. Okay, did we get a crawler? We did! Yeah, he's an adorable little guy. Right, let's get rid of these guys. Oh my. Whoa, there's one behind me! <sighs> I hate that sound when you hear one growl right on your ear. Especially with my surround sound headset. <laughs> I'll leave him for a minute and I'll try and get this generator on. Watch your backs. They're all over us. Oh crap, he's moving fast. That's not what I had in mind. That's not what I had in mind at all! I'm almost out of bullets, that's even worse. Come on! Yes! Alright. And the box ain't here. Great. So I'll just buy some ammo off the wall, I guess. Yeah. Sure goes fast for someone without legs. Shit. Strong upper body. Oh, hello. Through talking to you. And yeah, I'm kind of aware that can happen. I was hoping not. I could do with some more bullets, more than anything. Points are always welcome. Let's go this way. Let's see where this goes. Ooh. This is like the workshop. And that sounds like an Easter egg. No one's somewhere up here. No Man's Land! Great, uh, what's this? No Man's Land! So either way, we're going to No Man's Land! Oh boy! I'm gonna regret this before that out. There's maybe any other way to go. One of those robots nearly crushed us! First time I've had a clear look at it. Holy shit. <laughs> That's about my opinion as well. Whoa! Almost kicked me in the head. Christ. I can't imagine how you're supposed to fight something like that. Damn it. Barely move in this mud. Oh crud, the zombie died. Should have guessed that would happen. What's this? Excavation site, cool. Why would I go there? I can't remember why that's relevant. I think the staff parts are down there, aren't they? The Richtofen. It's another of your crazy machines. And again, I think this is actually where the pack. Ah, Ow! Get away from me! The mood for this shit. Ah, come on! Where is he? I'm gonna get a piece of my gun right here. Come here. Alright, grabbing that. That did not go well. Usually I can last a bit longer than that before I leave the house! First mistake was touching me. Second was sticking around. Okay, this is really not good. I need Juggernog and I need it now. I am not gonna last very long without it. Guess I can rack up some points on my way back down. I'm trying to rack my brains for why I'd go to the excavation site right now. I don't think there's anything there that I can really use. And the box is that way, so I might start in this direction. I need to know where Juggernog is, and unfortunately that's one of the things I'm not privy to from prior knowledge. Man, this map is huge. What's down here? Workbench. I don't have anything I can build. Let's check. Nothing here. God. So amazing. Where am I? Am I going into the excavation site? Crazy place. <laughs> Sounds like the kind of place I want to go. Not that I can. Nothing here. Hmm. Oh god, I just realized I'm cornered. I have no Juggernog and nothing that's going to help me. 
Looks like I'm just gonna have to fight my way out. Nope. This may be the shortest let's play of a map in history. Because I am not gonna. Oh, hey, that was the last number. Alright, well, I'm gonna try and head back. I'm gonna see if I can locate my way back to the spawn so I can get another quick revive. Nothing else. I'm gonna need that. You have to help me. Please. There is a way to open the gateway. My father was so close. He said, You have to follow the steps. I don't suppose you remember what he did. I'm kinda in the dark here. Makes two of us. Oh, Blood money. Ah, crap, they're getting close. What's that over there? Like some sparking. Is that one of the generators? I guess so. I can see another one just before it went down. Oh, this is a workshop. I wish I knew where I was going. I don't even know where the box is. It's another generator three. I need to get to generator one. Oh, wait, this is. Speed color over there. So I guess we'll go this way. I hope this is going back towards spawn. Ooh, hello. Shotgun. I mind if I do. Insta kill. You freaks ready for nice. a real fight? I think oh, I'm going on. Chambers were doorways. Opened by the songs of the ancients. Harness the elements. Only with yep. all can Garth be reached. I'm dead. Ah, crud. I told you this would be the shortest zombie let's play in history. I'm digging the game over music though. It's really awesome. Oh, I apologize my commentary was a bit dry. I was trying to keep it going, but at the same time I was kind of like a kid in a candy store trying to explore the map for the first time. Because my god, is it huge. Freaking amazing too. Putting the robots aside, it's a damn amazing map. I think Mob of the Dead might have just been edged out as my favorite map of all time. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Anyway, I'm just going to cut the recording for a second and restart it. I'll leave that as like a separate video. But I'm going to have another attempt. And then hopefully this one will last a bit longer, or it'll actually make some better progress. Anyway, I'll be back in about five seconds.